up, everybody? It is your boy Chance here. Hubbled. I mean, hubbled on a daily. You already know. All right, folks. Uh, it's been a while since I posted another. I know there's these long stretches where uh, I don't post a video all the time. Um, I got so much other stuff going on. I got my full-time job. I do photography on the side, so it's getting to that time of the year where there's senior shoots, engagement shoots, things like that. So I got to fill those in on my weekends. And then also I'm doing these videos. So uh, ah, staying busy. I know uh, I'll be lucky if I'm still married here after a while. I mean, I'm just busy, busy, busy. But having said that, let's get into another reaction, shall we? Because I haven't forgot about you folks. I'll tell you that right now. I'm not forgetting about you. Just busy, busy, busy is all it is. Uh, so this one here is uh, Matt Corby. This was a, a suggestion from somebody out there that uh, said, hey, listen, you should take a look at um, Matt Corby's, uh, what is it called here? So, Song for Interlude. Song for Interlude. I know that's a mouthful, but uh, let's hear it. And if I'm not mistaken, Matt Corby, because I didn't go back and listen to his other stuff, because I like to not listen to stuff so I can be surprised when I hear it. If that makes sense. Uh, but this is uh, Matt Corby. I think the guy is the one, he kind of had that really storytelling voice. If I remember the song correctly. Brother or something. Ah, it doesn't matter. But I'm almost positive this is the same The same uh, Matt Corby. He's got that real, like that storytelling kind of voice. So ah, let's get into it, shall we, folks? Fuck it. Let's get into it. All right, Matt Corby. Song for Interlude. This is live on the Resolution Tour. Man, look at those, those big-ass words. These are the words that you need to give Harry Mack on his stuff. Uh, if you know who Harry Mack is. I don't know. I assume that people do, but maybe they don't know. All right, here we go. Matt Gorby. On your marks. Get set. Let's get it. A million prayers went up to heaven. They went for nothing. A million pleas came back down. They said, Stop asking. So much blood on my hands. So much blood. He does. He's got a. He's got a fantastic, fantastic voice for. Um, storytelling it's just i don't know something very deep and mysterious about it i just i love that that tone his tone is like sick good but doesn't it look like and this is no disrespect to him he looks like the they just yanked the homeless guy off the street and said here here's a guitar get up there and do something we got to pay <laughs> these people paid money we got to give them something he kind of has the homeless look i'm sorry it's just the way i feel but uh he don't sound homeless i'll tell you that Look right there. I think he's got a hole in his shirt. That's all I'm saying. I'm just, I'm, that's all I'm leaving alone. But I think he's got a hole in his shirt. Should be recognized. It's duly noted. Write it down. So much blood on my Okay. All right. All right. I had to say this real quick because 
anybody who's watched my channel from a long time ago, back in the Nightwish days, know that I, I really like live shit, right? Because live stuff is just raw, and there's something very, very enticing about it to me, for me, personally. But I love, like if I back up to, right? Oh, back, I'll show you. I'll stop it. Here, just, right, right. right there. Okay. So look, I love this setting here. The music is, it's got that one, basically a one note entry, just hitting the old, the old uh, keyboard, dung, dung. It, it gives it like this real, like a metronome kind of sound. And then he's basically singing the only person really making any kind of noise within the whole setup. So you're focused on him big time, his voice. But they accommodate the lights to do the same thing. Like if you look at these lights right here, every band member's got a, their own little set of light, their own little light shining down on them. But the one that's on Matt Corby is these two real bright ones. Like, so it's enough to say, hey, look, I got a band. Here they are. They're kind of hanging out in the background for right now. And I'm the main focus. It's like in, in uh, photography, vignetting, where you darken the corners and it makes your eyes go to the center of the, of the picture so you can light up your talent. Same thing's going on right here with Matt Corby. He is all lit up. He's the only voice singing. The, the piano player is just hitting one, a little one-note little thing. It's really to focus in on Matt and what he's doing. Loving it. It's badass. It's so badass. The angels cry. We can do nothing. Our hearts were sunk Cause the focus of our prayers Was fraudulent yet were we That the Lord's friend Would come so much more Like, this song, it has, this sound is so cool. This sound, is, it it sounds like he's in, um, you're like in a, in a um, kind of like a really echoey, kind of echoey chamber kind of sound. But it also delivers this sound of like a lot of empty space. That's what I'm envisioning. Like, if you were making a movie right now and you stuck this song in there, I would put this song on a scene. Like, let's say there's... Um, like back in the, in the in the Viking days, there's one guy, he's running across a field, like a field with tall grass. So you can basically see from waist up, he's running for his life like this. And up over the hill comes a whole group of other fucking, you know, assassins wanting to kill him. And he is hauling ass, but it's in slow motion in this movie. And he's running across this big, vast field, like big landscape. 
this song, the sound of it is real vast and open. And I don't know, his, his voice, it's a freaking soundtrack. He's got a soundtrack, movie soundtrack voice. Hey, there we go. That's, that's what I'm going with. He's got a movie soundtrack voice. It's so good. Ah, let's go. Let's just get it. Okay, that was really good. His, that's it. I'm going with that. I'm sticking with what I just said. He is, he's, if I was going to make a movie, that's exactly, I would go to Matt. I'd say, hey, Matt, listen, dude, this is my movie setup. I got a couple of scenes. One scene is going to be doing this. Another scene is going to be doing this. Can you just write two real riffs for my two scenes? Because his voice is such a movie soundtrack voice. It's just, I don't know, something about it, you know? Like like when you watch the old movie, The Breakfast Club, whatever, this is the soundtrack of it. It has that freaking memorable, a memorable voice for a movie. That's where I'm going with that. Kick ass. Another great suggestion. Matt Corby, he's, he's legit, man. That's legit. He's got a, he, there's a niche for him in the industry for sure. Loved it. That was Matt Corby, uh, song for interlude. Badass. Thank you very much for that. All right, so if this is your first time on this channel, welcome in. Really appreciate it. I really, 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 really do. And if you're here all the time, shout out to you guys. High five for the support. Like the video. Subscribe if you haven't already so you can get the, the reactions when they come out. And then share the video if you're like, man, I thought you had a pretty good insight on the video. And I want to share this with a friend. Bam, send it out there. It helps the channel for sure. All right, folks, I'm Chaz Albert. That was another reaction, compartmentalized off into the archives. I will see you guys on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Booyah.